Welcome to 10 plus one things webinar series on what you need to do to succeed online. We are today on episode four, how to build an offer stack, how to build an offer stack. I'm Paul Uduk, the creator of Bull Writing Clinic and Internet Business Mastery Course. Let's get started. I plead with you to reset yourselves, reset yourselves, S-A-I-L-S, so that you can cruise with confidence in the turbulences ahead. Reset to leap forward. Reset to leap forward. Our motto, this motto is the motto that we employ in Internet Business Mastery course, is we serve. Our motto is we serve. We serve our clients. Because we serve them to able to unlock value for them. And in the process, we get paid. In the process, we get paid. Yes. Getting paid is the end product of delivering service. Is the byproduct of delivering service. Therefore, you must be out there for the customer and Make sure that you abide by this motto. We serve. We serve. Okay, so you must build your business pipeline. You must build your business pipeline. And we say that this business is a marathon. It is not a hundred meters dash. It is not a hundred meter. It's not a hundred meters uh, sprint. It is a marathon. Therefore, you must focus and you must build it. From the position of strength, from the position of wisdom, and from the position of knowledge, all right? This is your business pipeline. Your whole essence is to get prospects into this pipeline. Yeah, to get prospects, your target audience, is through referrals, serendipity, all forms of ways to get prospects into your pipeline and start building your business. And at this end is where you execute, where you implement. Therefore, a whole essence is to build, get customers into this pipeline and build the business. We're not going to go deep into that. Our offer stack. Therefore, to make your offers, you must learn to create offer stacks. To make your offer irresistible, the value should be a minimum of 10 times the price you are selling your product or service. For example, you can offer a product valued at $100,000 for only $8997 or a product valued at $10,000 for just $999. That is how you make your offer irresistible. American call this a no-brainer. A no-brainer means that you don't need to think so hard to decide that, yes, this is an offer that I cannot afford to miss. Okay? So, learn to do offer stacks. In our Internet Business Mastery course, we emphasize positioning and pricing your product appropriately. Appropriately. Avoid the cheap end because cheap end are for commodities. Use tired pricing. For instance, customers that are already with you, you can give them better offer than new customers and so on and so forth because existing customers are more valuable than the ones you do not know yet. I say, do not sell products. Sell packages sell packages and then make your offers irresistible these are the things that we emphasize day in and day out in internet business mastery course and then this is step six in the internet business success formula or internet business success model step six master online marketing and sales they, this last point here lmio learn how to make irresistible offers. Learn how to make irresistible offers. These are all the steps that you need to take and culminating in making irresistible offers. So what are the things to do? Let's just look at them. How to use marketing to grow your business. Understand the psychology of buying and buyer behavior. Learn how to build your business pipeline. Learn how to build and optimize your sales funnel. Learn how to craft sales scripts that convert. Learn how to use social media for marketing. And then learn how to set up your landing page. Finally, learn how to make irresistible offers. Irresistible offers. 
How do you get your customers? You get the customers from all over the world, from all over the world. This is the uh, funnel that we talk about. A funnel is a metaphor. It's a, a process of bringing in customers into your sphere of influence, into your marketing sphere, and then doing things, taking action to convince the customer that, yes, the value you have will solve their existing problems. A customer comes in with a pain point. A customer comes in with aspiration. You know the customer more than the customer knows himself. And then you package services. You package solutions that will solve the customer's problem. So this is the metaphorical funnel. You drive the customer. There are three levels in the funnel, the, middle, the top of the funnel, the middle of the funnel, and the bottom of the funnel. And each of these uh, stages, you use different strategies and tactics to convince the customer to build a relationship, to nurture the relationship, and give the customers uh, what we call breadcrumbs, lead magnet, that drive the, keep driving the customer from all over the internet. Your, your blog, your email list, your social media channels, and so on and so forth, drive the customer. And then you can also use the sales radar, which is a, 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 a different way of looking at it. Through content marketing, digital prospecting, mobile marketing, digital strategies, keynote speaking, and email marketing. And then, as the customer progresses down the funnel, you do sales contact. And then, on the right here, on the right here is the value ladder, the value ladder. As the customer moves from one stage of the, the ladder to the next, you are adding more value to the customer, and the price is changing. So that is how you build your funnel radar, and it's part of the, uh, the offer stack. Because as the customer goes deeper and deeper into, the, into your funnel, you are adding more value to the customer, and you are making more, more and more offers. All right? So this, this thing does not really require, it's not a matter of a lock, it's not a matter of a, anything. It requires data. Looking at what the customer does at their website, at their blog, or in all interactions with the customer, you are looking at the data. On the right-hand side here is above the funnel. We said that three parts to the funnel, above the funnel, in the funnel, and the best few in the funnel are the ones that you close. Then you give order, right? On the right-hand side here is the tracking of what the customer does in your funnel. Don't forget at the top of the funnel here is the universe. You are qualifying the customer at this point. You are trying to understand what the customer, at least, and sometimes we call them suspects at that point, or prospects. You are just trying to understand what they are looking for, what solutions that will be, will be best for them. So you are reaching out to them through your email uh, list, your email marketing, you are giving them your front-end product, or what sometimes we call it entry-level products. We call them uh, front-end subscription, flagship courses, membership sites, live events, and private coaching. All these things are part of the value ladder, okay? So, as I said, that it does not depend on luck. You have to track everything the customer does in your website, in your blog. At the back end, you can track all these things. So you can see here, data suggests a potential fit. Data suggests a possible order. Data verifies a possible order. Clearly defined next steps. Little or no luck involved. This thing is not something that just happened in the past two or three hundred or two or four or five years. This thing has been on by uh, this uh, Miller Heyman that propounded this uh, in his one of his uh, sales books, very, very powerful sales book, uh, which he called uh, Consultative uh, Marketing, if I'm not mistaken. So, this is a very powerful uh, tool for sales okay the funnel metaphor the funnel metaphor where you just drive the customers and then study what the customer does and now propounding solution preferring preferring solution to the customer's problems so let's give for example that these things don't happen in a vacuum these things don't not happen in a vacuum you must have products and services that you are giving to the customer for instance this is my ip my intellectual property, all right? I have experience annex, have book writing clinic, have scribble, executive book solution, have iSchool, have experience TV, have IBMC, and these are my books 
bridges to the customers that the gods of quality strike back well beyond your ima imagination. Oh, Calgary. And then spring flowers. And then the celebrity speaker. Then, of course, have our expert build empire. Then content marketing, Internet Business Foundation course. And of course, I have IBMC. And I, of course, I have vision knowledge base. And then I have a collection of articles, my ultimate guides, which you can use as private label rights. And of course, hi, ask Paul. Hi, welcome. Ask Paul is a, a Facebook group that we have. And we still, right now, we have more than 2,400 members in this uh, Facebook group. So this is that I said that these things do not happen by accident. You must have intellectual property from which you can make your offers and then you'll be able to get the customer to buy and then you monetize your effort let's look at the typical uh, offer sir. this is a, an irresistible offer for instance i said that it should be at least 10 not more than 10 percent 10 percent i mean sorry uh, 10 times what you offer the price you give should be not more than not more than more, not more than uh, should be 10 times the value you give should be 10 times the price all right um am i saying the right thing i said the price the price should not be more than 10 10 or the offer should be at least 10 times the price you are giving at least the offer should be at least the value of what you give the customer should be more than 10 times the price you are selling your product so i'm making it um i'm, I'm making it clearer now that Look at this. The total value here is 1.32. 1.32. If you want to call this dollars or naira, the Nigerian uh, Nigerian currency, all right? 1.32 million, and then what you pay is only 75,000. So you can see that this is far less than 10% of this, which is a very very irresistible offer. All right? This is what the customer gets. In all the customer will get IBMC course 225, IBMC Foundation course, write publish your book in 90 days, book writing clinic, uh, all the Monday webinars, all the private the private membership of private Facebook group, membership of the WhatsApp group, and then experience experience annex. And then of course Legends Network, where you can do JVs with. So all these things add to about 1.32 and you are offering it at only 75. So this is a type of offer that is completely irresistible. It would be like um, the Americans would say, it is a, a no-brainer. It's a no-brainer. It is something that is so good that the customer will be willing to put his hand in his pocket and pay you. So this is what um, irresistible offer is all about. So this will be the end of our... Uh, of our presentation at this moment there's no q and a right here when people ask me is that how can you make irresistible offer if you do not have your ip when you do not have your ip then uh, i don't think you can really make it or you, unless you are doing services but you need to highlight your services all right so of course for you to learn more for you to learn more i would advise you to join ibmc internet business mastery course Internet Business Mastery course runs every three months. Runs every three months. So find and join Internet Business Mastery course. So this will be the end for now. And thank you very, very much. And bye for now.